Hello lovely people. Uh, today I'm actually going to be showing you how to pack your makeup in this amazing compartment. As you can see, uh, it comes with multiple dividers so you can definitely divide it however you'd like. I have all my go-to palettes. Um, first is my Dose of Colors palette which has a really good mix of neutrals as well as nighttime looks. Um, so I can really do anything with this palette so I definitely take it on the go with me. I also have my Baked Browns palette by Dose of Colors. There are Missing, but that's because they broke sadly another one of my favorites is the makeup Shayla perception palette it literally has every color you can imagine um, and it has an amazing transition shade as you can see I love it very much a really good inner corner shade and really good darks and neutrals the next palette I have here is from Juvia's Place. It's kind of an unconventional palette but it definitely has colors that are my go-to's especially this inner corner like look at that it's amazing and look how just and this is this video is not doing it justice it's definitely way more like bam in your face than that and look at how that gold it's everything so if you really definitely want to play with colors or have some good neutrals that's a good palette to go to next is my fenty palette uh, which has a lot of good different colors of sparkly shades um that's why i really like it because i could really just go ham with it and have a lot of fun with it it has a really good mix of shades and i definitely highly recommend it um, as you could see i couldn't stop talking about it the next one is definitely a staple on modern renaissance by anastasia beverly hills and it just you can do any look with this very neutral so it's really really good for any type of look you're going for so now I'm going to show you how you're going to go ahead and pack these up. It's really, really simple. You just kind of got to configure your way through it. So the next thing I'm going to be putting away is the highlighters. Now, as you can see, I'm a really big fan of the Master Chrome highlighters. Um, don't mind my broken one, but I do love the holographic shade, the rose gold shade, and the gold shade. It really is good for any kind of look that you're doing, so it's good to have all three. Um, maybe it's overkill, but I honestly love all three. Um, the next one is my Fuego from Dose of Colors Desi X Kitty Collection. It's a really good highlighter. It's not too blinding, but it's just the right amount. So I go ahead and stuff it in there. I'd rather have my um, compartments really stuffed so that way nothing is going to move around or break when I'm traveling. These are some of my favorite blushes. Peaches, as you can see, it's <laughs> down to the pan. So it's one of my favorites. Milani Rose de Oro. And I just try to get a good mix of different types of blushes um, so that I could get them to go with any makeup look. Next here, I have my bronzers and my pressed powder. Um... These are just my go-tos. I honestly like all of them for different reasons. Some of them have a little bit of shimmer in them. Some of them are a little more uh, cool toned and some of them are a little more warm toned. Next thing is my Laura Mercier translucent powder and it fits perfectly in this little slot I created for it. Um, yeah, we need to protect that at all costs. So <laughs> that's going there and it's not moving. <laughs> Next thing I have are my lipsticks, lip glosses, and chapsticks. Um, I have a lot, <laughs> so it was kind of hard to like show you how w every single one. So I just uh, stack them standing if they're short enough. And oh my god, I had to show you guys this one because this is Quickie by ColourPop by Shayla. Yeah, Shayla X ColourPop. Uh, it's one of my favorite nudes. Honestly, she really knows how to make lipsticks. Like, nudes is her thing. Here I have my go-to chapsticks, my Nivea and Carmex. Can't live without those. And they're pretty affordable, so honestly, anybody can get them. Next thing I have, I actually wasn't filming when I did this by accident, um, but I have all my liners in this top compartment that's for brushes. Um, and here right now, as you can see, I'm putting in my glitter liners um, just because I need a little spot for them. Next things next is my lashes. Um, don't mind that blue box. It didn't have anything in it because uh, I was wearing the lashes. So yeah, but I was going to pack those anyways. So I'm just kind of showing you, you could fit a lot of lashes in here. <laughs> I do have individuals, a fuller set and something a little more natural. Now I'm going ahead and putting in the other compartment. There's a lot more compartments, so if you feel like you can, you want these spaces smaller, you can definitely do that. Go ahead and pop them right in here, but just because there's a lot of empty space there, so why not? I pack my NARS concealers, my Maybelline concealer, my Lancome concealer, and my Fenty concealer. Right now, right now, those are some of my favorite concealers on the low end and on the high end. Uh, NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer is honestly always one of my faves. 
Next is skin. I have my foundations and my primer. Right now I'm using the Hydro Grip Primer. I don't know if I love it yet. I've used it twice, but I'll definitely let you guys know if I'm a fan. Uh, next, I have my lip liners here, and I ended up finding out that this was just the best spot for them. I was going to put them where the brushes are at, but I just felt like this was a better spot for them. Again, that is the Shayla X ColourPop collection, uh, the liquid lipstick. I think it's BFF3, and honestly, again, her she's just really, really good at doing collaborations. These are my go-to mascaras right now. The Climax Mascara is by far my ultimate favorite. If they come out with a waterproof version, I will 100% get it. <laughs> there's me being clumsy as per usual and trying to find a spot for these again next i have here my real techniques and beauty blender that i go ahead and just kind of put them anywhere these are my setting sprays my go-to all-nighter and my mac fix plus next i have my brushes and we all know where those are going uh they're going right up here um don't mind that some of them aren't clean. I haven't clean, gotten the chance to clean all my brushes yet. I wanted to film this video while there was still daylight outside. So I'm not actually packing these like this. I will be washing them. So don't come at me, please. Thank you so much. And I can't forget my makeup wipes. This is everything all packed up, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, yeah, so this is an amazing luggage. I will link down where I got it from. I actually got it from Amazon, but I'll link down the information below. So if any of you guys want to get it, it is really good. It does come in a bigger size, so if you feel like you need something bigger, it is well worth it. Um, thank you again so much for watching. Uh, like this and yeah. All right, and I'm just going to go ahead and uh, exit out here now and uh, bye.